This is the Reaction AI SDK demo um, video of a sample implementation of Reaction AI SDK. What you're seeing here on the screen is um, the JSON input personality file, which initializes the personality of the NPC to start with. Uh, the question is, have you ever played an AI-based NPC quite as human as this? The female character you will see is the avatar controlled by you, and the shaman is the AI driven by the Reaction AI SDK. It will learn over time and try its best to survive, yet be slightly flawed by design. The code is structured as the core lobes of the human brain. The quote-unquote best solution may not result due to less active neurons stimulated, stimulated by the avatar's move. This is all behind the Reaction AI SDK, where it's only about 500 lines of code for the sample implementation, where the whole AI engine is behind eight API calls total and the implementation of the success algorithm. Your NPC will not only be different every time a brain is created, but slightly variant per stimuli of the avatar's action. Um, what to notice in the demo is um, red means avatar has received full damage. Uh, blue avatar has received partial damage due to doing block one or block two, depending on the NPC attack. Yellow means the NPCs had full damage. Magenta means NPC has partial damage due to block one or block two, depending on the avatar attack. White means there's no character damage, either by no actions taking place or the characters are using a full block for that particular um, AI NPC or avatar's attack. In the UI, the top left is the avatar health, the top right is the NPC health, the middle UI is the success statistics. Um, it's based on the last 30 samples of uh, actions. Um, a percentage of 50% means avatar is not losing, not winning, but still beatable. Um, so it's, it's balancing itself out. You'll want to see the success rate gradually increase over time. Um, the NPC will move every 1.25 to 2 seconds um, as well. A couple things to observe, if you see magenta and it was yellow before that attack, the AI has learned one way to protect itself partially. If you see white where it was yellow or magenta, um, before that the AI has learned to protect itself fully. You will notice um, attack behavior changing of the, av of the NPC when the avatar has learned how to block certain actions. So it will adjust itself, the NPC AI will adjust itself um, by noticing how much damage the avatar has uh, has, has been inflicted upon. So let's get to the demo. So magenta means the, av the NPC partially blocked and it's learned now to full block this attack. And now he's attacking, and I'm partially blocking, so he changed his attack. Um, so you can see, based on what I said, the color codes and what they mean and how it's evolving over time. So you see, so now I've fully blocked, and the NPC has changed its move. Um, I fully blocked, and the NPC has changed its move again. So I'm partially blocking here with the blue. Um, I want to try to full block, and the NPC changes its attack. You see now the success rate is about 56%. Um, I'm now actually inflicting full damage to the NPC, but now he has uh, learned to partially block this attack and eventually should be able to fully block uh, the attack if I continue with this. And let's see if that happens. So he's attacking, so it knows that attack is a good move when this happens. Um, so I partially blocked. Now I full blocked, and he's changed his attack. So I'm inflicting full damage, and he's learned to block it fully. So I changed my attack. He's learned to uh, block it partially. And he has also learned to now block it fully. So this is just a sample demo of how the NPC has learned over time in choosing which action to counter with um, against the avatar. So I fully blocked, and he's changed his attack to a full block, um, and so on and so forth. So you see, this demo is available um, in the link provided, and you can see over time that the NPC has 
a success rate about 50 in the range of 50, 40 to 50 uh, percent, which is good, which means that it's beatable um, and not optimal, which makes it very human-like. Um, so this is just a sample implementation of the Reaction AI SDK. Um, you can get it on Unity, uh, and uh, feedback is appreciated. Try the demo for yourself. See how the NPC learns over time. Um, so it's it's actually doing quite well right now in terms of uh, my behavior, adjusting to the behavior that I'm doing, um, and and learning over time based on its quote unquote brain and the stimuli that I'm applying every time I perform an action. Um, Thanks for watching the video. Let's actually go through a bit more just to give you some more sample points. It's fully blocked, partially blocked, partially blocked, full damage, attack. I'm partially blocked. I'm full blocked, he changes attack. I'm partially blocking. He still wants to attack like this because he's getting damage inflicted on me. I partially block, I fully block, he changed his attack. Now if I start attacking, uh, if I can, <laughs> um, I fully inflicted damage and now the AI should start blocking um, completely, but he's attacking which is just doing him good. Um, So in this mode, he's actually learned to attack more than block more. Um, it's all variant on the data points it gets and the behavior. So we partially block that attack. It's a full damage. It was also a full block into attack. Full damage to partial damage. And let's see if he actually performs a full block. And there it is. Thanks again for watching.